Hi, my name is Nick Iannacone. I'm a service consultant here at Lexus Route 10 Service Department. And um, I'm here to tell you about uh, this pesky little light over here called the tire pressure warning light. Um, this is gonna come on for a couple of different reasons. Number one, uh, if your threshold uh, is set at a certain PSI level, which is usually around the 31, 32 PSI level, what will happen is uh, that the tire pressure sensors are gonna sense that the pressures have dropped and they're gonna to need to be adjusted. This time of the year, being the winter time, hot and cold tire pressure varies. So when it gets very cold out, especially when your car is sitting out overnight, what's gonna happen is the pressures will drop. Sometimes after you start driving the car and the wheels get heated up from the friction on the ground, they'll start to expand uh, and that light will go off. But then again, the next night, it's gonna go on again. So this time of the year, it's very important to bring it in so we can get it checked out. Uh, if you're interested in finding out what your tire pressures are, here on the dash with your little control panel on this uh, trusty switchboard on the steering wheel. Uh, if you are on your information tab, all you have to do is scroll down and it'll bring you right to where your tire pressures are. And as you can see here, our tire pressures are varying between 37 PSI all the way down to 25 PSI. 25 PSI is very low, especially since the other ones are relatively close. So that's telling me that you probably have a leak in your left rear tire. If all of them are equally low and the light is on, usually it's probably gonna have to be set, uh, just, just moved up for the winter time, which is about 36 PSI to compensate for the cold weather that's coming. You know where to come if you need us. Stay, stay tuned for the next Tech Tuesday.